I received a very good question from a viewer. I was pretty much speaking about how to separate yourself from sinful people that are influencing you to do the wrong things. So this viewer asked, how can I separate from them? Give me a second, please. So what you can do, you can give them very poor excuses. You can say to them that you are busy. Many people use that excuse. Or what you can say, you can say that you have things that you have to do. Or what you can say, hey, there are some important things or not so much important but something serious is happening so I may have to do some other things or I may not be able to contact you as much or something like that just use any random excuse really like you don't really have to tell them well well which you can, you can say, I am serving God now, so I can't be around people who don't serve God. You can say that. You can be straight up and honest like that. You know, straight to the point. Or you can say, well, I can't hang with you anymore because you are causing me to sin. <laughs> usually when you are straight with people, they usually don't take it too well. When people are straight with me, I usually take it much more well other than a person being very vague. I do not like people being vague with me. Uh, just tell me what's on your mind, period. You know, I believe that you can be straight up with a person and be respectful at the same time. Like when a person beats around the bush with me. Now, let me say this. There are people who I can't be straight with because they will argue and fuss with me. So usually what I do, I just tell them I don't want to say. <laughs> because I don't want to get into any argument or anything like that. So does that make any sense? You can give them any random excuse which many people already do when they are not interested in you, they give you very bad excuses, like they are busy or something like that. Well, even if you are busy or whatever else, you still make time for things that you want to do. So being busy is not a good excuse <laughs> because I have been busy many times, but if there's something that I want to do, I make time for it. So busy, no. But these are some ways that you can separate from people who are influencing you to do bad things. You can be straight up with them and say, hey, I can't hang with you or speak with you because you are causing me to do wrong things or you can be very vague. You can say, hey, there are things that I have to do or some serious things are happening, which is true. You are changing your life. So some serious, <laughs> some serious things are happening. So, you know, I may not be able to speak with you as much or somewhere around that guideline, which is true. You changing your life is something serious. And or you can say, well, I have to figure some things out, like something really tough is happening, which is true. Changing your life is tough. So many ways to separate from people who are causing you to sin. So many ways. So just think of one. Just don't lie. Just don't stretch the truth so much to the point where you are lying. But the best thing to do is to be straight up with that person. 
tell that person, hey, I can't mess with you anymore because I am trying to change my life. Like I said, myself, there are quite a bit of people who I can't be straight up with because if they would attack me, not so much like hit me or nothing like that, but like say just silly things or they get their feelings hurt and stuff like that. So they will tell me about myself or whatever they think about me. You know, that foolish things like that. So either I say, hey, I don't want to say or it is a secret. <laughs> <laughs> or I tell them what's going on if they are the type who can handle it so you have to know who you are dealing with pretty much if you know that person is going to explode and everything like that you shouldn't really talk to people like that anyways so I really hope you understand this. God bless.